Hi guys, so this is just going to be a really, really quick tutorial video to show you how to upload the Magpie Glitter um, slash Magpie Beauty logos onto your photos using an app called PixArt. Um, now I'm showing you on the iPhone, there is also a video for the Android. Obviously, slight disclaimer, there are other apps out there that do exactly the same thing. Um, there are easier ways of doing this. This is just my quick way to show you how to do it in a very basic mode. Um, now, you'll see here, this is the photo that I've originally taken and I've added this logo, which is my logo, and the Magpie Glitter logo at the top. So I'm just going to show you how to do that. Stay tuned. So if you just go back on to Facebook, go on to Magpie, this is how you find the photo that you need to uh, use to put on. This is the main screen for Magpie Beauty slash Magpie Glitter page. You hit the info button in the top right hand corner, hit photos, albums, and then you can pick any of the albums, Sarah's very very nicely put them all in there anyway. You need to hit Magpie Glitter, press and hold it, save that photo. So you need to download this lovely little app in the bottom left hand corner here, it's Pixar. Um, you can download that off the iStore, if you click on it, just load it all up. Okay, so as you load the screen, it takes a couple of seconds. Sometimes this menu pops up at the bottom, sometimes it doesn't. If it doesn't, your page will look like this, um, in which case you'll press the orange button at the bottom and it will bring up the menu. Um, hit edit, find the picture that you want to edit. I'm just going to use a really old photo here of some Valentine's nails that I've done. Um, and I'm going to add the Magpie logo. I've added my logo to the bottom here. Um, and these are done with Magpie pigments, so kind of fitting. Um, so you're going to hit edit in the top right hand corner just then, I've just done. Then you are going to hit add photo, this little button on the bottom here. You're going to select the Magpie logo out of your photos. You're going to hit add at the bottom. That will come up with a nice lovely box over the top. That's not what we want. We want to multiply it which drops the screen out of the background. I don't know if you can see here if I just zoom in. There is the Magpie Glitter logo. Now you can, as you've just seen, I've just done it there, you can pinch it to make it bigger and smaller. Here. You can move it around if you just click and hold. And you can rotate it using this button in the top right hand corner, just up there. So position it wherever you want it. I fancy having it there. This is just a sample video anyway, so it doesn't really matter that you can't see the background, but you can do it wherever you like on that photo. Um, then you're going to hit the tick in the bottom right hand corner to place that. Now you cannot move that unless you undo what you've just done, um, but that is there now. And then you hit this download button once you're happy with your picture. You hit the download button in the top middle and that will save it to your camera roll. Done. Thank you very much for watching guys. This is my first video so bear with me um, and it's the first time I've actually edited a video to put together like this as a tutorial so go easy on me. Um, like I say there are other apps that can do this. There are more simple ways of doing it. This is just a very basic video to show you how it's done. Again this is for iPhone um, and I've downloaded PixArt via the App Store. Um, there is a version for Samsung or slash Android. Um, just head on over. I'll put the link below. Thank you very much.